Hi, welcome to the videos. And we have a Gen 8 ML350P server. This has the 6 bay large form factor format. And quite easy to take it out the empty cage. And the upper. The Gen 8 and the Gen 7 caddies look different so make sure you fully insert and then clip it on if you bought the wrong caddy it won't work because on the back there they got a smart sensor yep just insert the hard drive fully insert and clip it on and let's see inside full fan kit the fourth fan need to be installed if you have two CPU CPU 1, CPU 2 and this has 8GB module fully loot make up 192GB RAM the additions P420 just to upgrade the firmware so you don't need to install that one and it has the catch module 2GB catch later we're gonna go in the catch the P420 setup menu to have a look on the rate functions so, so yeah. Let's power on. I have some customer complain that they don't like to see the slideshow of the photo. So they asked for a live video like this, which you can introduce more about the server. And it's not so noisy when it boots. It's like the Gen 6. Yeah, so let's see how the screen. As you can see on the back of the server, it got two PSU and it's quite it's very quiet it's not so noisy the firmware is p72 on the bios you need a hp service tool to update it For the ILO self, you need to press F4, but F8 um, when it show the P420, you can press F8 to enter the rate configuration menu. Uh, here, here you come to GB catch. So F8 to run the biological drive. We currently have the 3 times 4 TB set up, and we got addition three of the two terabytes hard drive. So, if you, if you see on the right hand side of the menu, you can go right 60, 50, 6, 5, 1 plus 0. Just depend how you want to run it. Usually, I pick up the red 5. If you have the catch module installed, then you will have more functions. If you take out the catch module, it will have only like red 1 and red 0. You don't have the 5, 50, 60. So, Quality group. Okay. When when you have six six terabytes make up of three times two TB, you will only have four TB available. So F8, we're saving the configurations. Yep. Set up. So we build the logical drive. It's already have three times four TB. And 
here's the another one. Yeah. So the two array. I'm gonna keep setting. Enable. Okay, skip. When the server is, is put up, it won't be so noisy. Here, how the this is the first tray of the two terabyte drive, which the VMware is installed, and this tree is just add in just now, which we set up a rate, and you can add another eight bay small form factor on here. If you want to run the SSD or SAS SSD on the small one, and And that's it here's the video and again it was very quiet when it's running and thanks for watching bye